Hey guys, so today, haven't I wore this outfit before? Okay, so I guess that's better. Hi guys, it's been a long time since I've actually talked about Korea since the past few videos has been all about me. Not saying that's a bad thing, but yeah. Anyway, today's topic is pre-cramming. Any of you who are even slightly interested in Korean culture or education will know what I'm trying to get at here. But for people that don't, I'll explain it as best as I can. Everyone is familiar with the term cramming, correct? Yeah. Okay. It refers to the practice of working intensely to absorb large volumes of information at a short time. And everyone's also probably aware of the prefix pre. I mean, if you know the word prefix, you should know the prefix pre which is in the word anyway pre cramming is a word that i made up referring pre cramming is a word that i made up referring to the act of learning something intensely to absorb large amounts of informational material before you have to like years back what you do is walk into a math hagwon and then they teach you a year's worth of study in a month. And at this moment, Jason decided to scratch his head in such a way that made his hair look really weird for the rest of the video. Previously on Dragon Ball Z, they teach you a year's worth of study in a month. So completely irrational in my mind. Also, if this is... Also, if this is a thing in other parts of the world too, I still despise Korean education and it'll always run in my blood. Conclusion, I've always doubted claims that state programming is even remotely effective. But Jason, you say you're not attending any hagwons. Why did this affect you? Well, that's an amazing question. And here's my answer. The widely accepted practice of programming makes my life stressful. Obviously, I find that free. Obviously, I find that pre cramming is bad and see no use in it. That's nice and dandy. But when everyone around me says things like, With your level of education, you will never be able to get good grades in your senior year, your high school, or college, or work. You know, that guy goes to Hagwon from 8 to 3 o'clock. He finishes a semester's worth of math in two days. Isn't that amazing? Yeah, that's amazing. I'm sure that'll help him in five years. Me being the guy not attending any hot ones and enjoying my vacation Just grazing over second grade material. I receive a lot of pressure from those people and because of them, I start thinking All of your friends are already learning high school math and what are you doing? Only studying what you are learning in school right now? You are a stupid, worthless person that will never succeed in life. Go ahead and just live in the woods eating dirt. <laughs> so that was my opinion. Hey guys, so I just finished my recording. Uh, it's quite late at night, but um, I would like to say some things like thank you all for such being loyal fans. Uh, I mean, it's obvious that we could achieve really amazing things. Like, it's obvious. It's black and white. And if your day hasn't been too great, don't be so blue and just find a way around it. Everything is going to be okay. I mean, everybody's got a pension for something. Try to be more open-minded. And if some things are just not going your way, roll with it. I should really go to bed.